So, there are n number of medications which are advised uh, for patients for their various uh, health conditions. But the important groups of drugs which can cause kidney damage can be categorized as follows. The first one is antibiotics, antivirals or antifungal medications. These are the medications which are given for infections whether it is a bacterial infection or viral infection or fungal infections. So, in the antibiotics usually the penicillin group of drugs like amoxicillin or cephalosporins like ceph uh, ceftriaxone or cefixim or uh, uh, cefpodoxime. These are the drugs which are usually culprits for this drug induced uh, kidney damage. In the antiviral drugs like acyclovir. So, what I am mentioning are few examples so that you will all uh, you all will get an idea about the drugs. Uh, this list is not, not exhaustive this is only an example. The, uh, what I mean to tell is that these are only examples of uh, the drugs which can cause kidney damage. So, uh, there are other antifungal medications also like amphotericin B. So, these are all the antibacterial or antifungal or antiviral drugs. The second category is the painkiller medication. So, this category is very, very important because these are the drugs which are available over the counter and can be misused, especially in patients uh, who have chronic symptoms of back pain or who are suffering from uh, joint pains or knee pains. They may unknowingly use these medications for longer duration, ultimately ending up in kidney failure. So, the important group of medications under the painkillers is the NSAIDs, which stands for non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs. The most important examples of this group are ibuprofen, diclofenac, acyclofenac. So, these are the drugs which are usually available over the counter. Chronic paracetamol overdose can also cause kidney damage. This also we need to keep in mind. Now, coming to third important category, this third category is also very, very important and it is usually uh, used very commonly in almost majority of the patients who visit to hospital. This category is the anti-acid group of drugs. The important group of medications in this category is proton pump inhibitors like pantoprazole, omeprazole, lansoprazole. These are the drugs which we use day in and day out for our acidity problems or indigestion problems. So, these drugs if they are used excessively or if they are misused can also cause kidney damage along with other problems. Now, coming to other category of drugs, the other category of drugs are like chemotherapeutic medications which are the medications which are used in patients suffering from cancers. The examples are like cisplatin, iphosphamide, these are the drugs which can cause kidney, kidney damage.